Hello everyone. I just wanted to do a quick video for you to let you know what is going on nowadays in the world of pots and pans. As you can see, I have this pan here. I just bought it, just got it in the mail, and it was supposed to be a nine by nine. But as you can see, this pan is not a nine by nine. And what they're doing is they are measuring the top of the pans to give you your inches, okay? Instead of actually turning it over, measuring the bottom like they used to do to give you your inches. This comes in at about a seven, a little over seven. If you measure the inside at the bottom, it actually measures six and a half, but they are selling this as a nine by nine. Now, this is my old Pyrex, okay? And I really wanted another one because I, I need to freeze some food. And this, as you can see, is an eight by eight. It will say 21 by 21, if I can get that in there. There it is, 21 by 21. Okay, that's eight inches. I can literally put this so-called nine inch pan by nine inch inside my eight by eight inch. So, and they're doing this on skillets as well. They are measuring the slanted tops of the pans and not measuring the bottom. So you think you're getting a 10 inch pan when you are actually getting an eight inch pan because they are not measuring the bottoms of these pans. And sometimes they will even measure from here over to the handle. And then you really think you're getting a big pan, but you're not getting a big pan. So lesson learned, whenever you are buying these, get the measurements from the bottom of the pan so you'll know exactly how big this pan is going to be. I'm really disappointed. They're doing it everywhere now, and it's really misleading because now I'm gonna have to buy a nine by nine, which I wanted. So I'm not turn returning this. It's very pretty. It's nice. I can use it, not what I wanted. And I've bought some other skillets, new skillets, that are not the measurements that they should be because they're not measuring the bottom they are measuring the tops so word to the wise either buy old get your good measurements or buy new and get fake measurements or just ask them to measure the bottom of the pan for you anyways i think it's misleading i think it shouldn't be that way but it is all right, well, good luck buying pots and pans.